Hi everybody, welcome to my channel Healthy Lifestyle A to C. This is Letty Smith. I will be sharing delicious, easy, healthy and fast recipes. I've been making them for myself and I want to share them with you. They're gluten free and no MSG. This is the key to a healthy, happy lifestyle. Don't forget to exercise and drink water. I will be sharing new recipes every Friday and I invite you to like, subscribe and share with your friends and family. Stay tuned. Best gluten free cassava banana bread. And this is the best banana bread I've made in my whole life. I made it for my daughters and now they don't stop making it. So that's a very good sign. Get all your ingredients together and here's the list. You're gonna need one cup cassava flour, three ripe bananas mashed, three eggs pasture raised, half cup butter, grass fed or oil of your choice. You can use coconut oil, three quarters of a cup of maple sugar or sugar of your choice. You can use brown sugar, one teaspoon vanilla, half teaspoon baking soda, one and a half teaspoons baking powder, half teaspoon cane Himalayan salt, one and a half teaspoons of cinnamon. You can add more cinnamon if you want. So get your bowl and add all your wet ingredients, your mashed bananas, your eggs, and your vanilla. You're gonna blend it, you're gonna mix it, or you can use like a pan mixer once it's all mixed, you're gonna, you're gonna get another bowl and you're gonna mix all your dry ingredients, your cassava flour, your baking powder, baking soda, your salt, and your cinnamon. You're gonna mix it together. You want all the ingredients to incorporate all the powders. And then you're going to pour your liquid mix into your dry mix. Make sure you're doing it by hand and you're not going to use a blender, a batter or anything because that changes how your banana bread turns out. So you're going to whisk it carefully and when your mix is ready, you're going to grease your mold. You're going to pour your mix into your mold. You're going to preheat your oven at 350 degrees and you're going to bake for 35 to 40 minutes. Looks good, right? I cut it into pieces and put it in the freezer and I get it out every time I'm up to a piece of banana bread. And now enjoy! I invite you to like, subscribe and share with your friends and family. And next week's recipe is going to be beet salad with mandarins and pistachios and beet salad with apples and walnuts. These are two different recipes with beets that I love them. Uh, they're healthy and they're so easy to make, very refreshing and very good. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned and see you next time.